Hello guys, my name is Vivek and today I'm here to teach you the basics of Linux. We'll start from the scratch. So even if you don't know anything about Linux, you can start from here. Alright, so my understanding that the intention of this class would be or the purpose of this class would be to teach you Linux from the very basic. Starting from which Linux to choose and how to install and then what are the basic commands and so on and so forth so in, in, in this lecture I'll, I'll tell you basically it's not a lecture just an introduction I'll tell you which Linux to choose from the most commonly used Linux flavors are Ubuntu Red Hat and CentOS. CentOS is nothing just a free release from Red Hat people so Red Hat Enterprise Linux is for enterprise customers whereas CentOS is being used on a day-to-day basis by many many service pro server providers <clears throat> many of the servers are running on either on CentOS or on Ubuntu so which one to choose you can choose either of them so CentOS and Red Hat Enterprise Linux their commands and syntax are more or less same whereas Ubuntu is little different the advantage of choosing Ubuntu is that if you are choosing Ubuntu, there are various help forums where people are very active and you will get instant help. So if you are a beginner, if you are just starting Linux, then I will highly recommend start with Ubuntu. All right. In next lesson, in next lesson, we'll, show, we'll talk about um, uh, the various uh, things to set up, how to install Linux on your um, main machine or you want to have a virtual machine installed uh, typically I will be using a VM a virtual machine because I need to re uh, reinstall OS multiple times to show you various things but if you want you can also install Linux on your base machine the advantage of Linux is that installing Linux is that it, it doesn't think that it's the only operating system available in the market unlike Windows so when you install Linux after installing Windows it knows that you already have an operating system and then you can either have a dual boot or only Linux as per uh, your wish so uh, if you are a beginner uh, you can install a virtual machine in your on your local machine like um, virtual box or you can also have a VMware installed on your system and play around 